And here's another enemy. Oh, I gotcha. For a moment there, I thought I heard another one. Thankfully, I did. Second signal crystal activated. You hear the stone door at the base of the cavern rolling open. Well, it kind of looks like I f f didn't notice side passages there. Whoops. Okay, here's another one. What if the enemies can slide off. Kind of missed opportunity if they can't. Okay, let's let's not fall off herself. There is a door just up here, and I'm curious what's in here. I'm guessing a chest, considering the control levers were in the other ones. Ah, Frostbite. The Spider Queen. Nice. 497 XP. Shit, yeah. And an ex axomatic. Rapier of Deadly uh, One. Uh, this weapon is righteous and wielded by those who stand against chaos, doing an additional 1d6 lawful da law damage on each hit. This makes the item lawful, lawfully aligned. And chaotic characters wielding this weapon suffer one negative level. Well, I'm a Howling, so I'm awful good, so I can wield this with no issue. But it's a one-handed weapon. That would it be, is a bit of reduction for me in damage. So I'll stick with what I have. Certainly I could run into a one-handed weapon that's better than this, but it wouldn't be at level. Like I'll be, you know, working at much higher tier gear, you know, in comparison to where this level is now. Like, uh, I, this is like exaggerated, but I might need to wait to level 5 for a final one handed weapon that's on the tier with this. Axe. It, that's probably not the case in Slidus, but you get my point. I'd have to go to higher level equipment than um, this. It's a bit of an unfair uh, competition then. Fuck. I was. Uh. Overestimated. Nice. Six of extra life. If I need to heal more, I, I have potions. Marrow from your bones. There we go. Nine extra life. There we go. As far as I know, there's no issue with me just popping a few potions or even resting a bit or anything, you know, in regards to this, so... May as well, I guess. Oh, ghouls. Christ, they should be sending more of these ghouls at me, because they are uh, a bit burlier. They take two, three hits to kill. Hey, they work. F fiddle with this. We're a bit further in. Guten Tag. Chills run down your spine as you finally come face to face with a dragon that has been terrorizing Korthos. Even at rest, it is a truly awesome beast. Town rating 26. I think I could actually try and engage it, but it, 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 it's, it's an insane idea. Um, you do not want the to actually engage the it. Of the cavern pops open. Cultists attracted by the roar of combat rush out to confront you. I guess they must be trying to lure the dragon that way. 
Challenge rating 26. Christ. Eesh. Yeah, that's that's far above us. <laughs> yeah. I'm having an easy time here because I'm finding point two five and point five oh uh five oh challenge ratings. Actually isn't the O and the other thing redundant? Like it's work it means the same thing if I just hit point five challenge rating. Regardless, it's you know, we're going up against pansies here, is what I'm saying. We fought a few challenge rating ones. Like that method and whatnot. I, I think uh, challenge rating 26 is a bit high level. Especially solo. Nice. Keep moving. Let's get here. Get up to them. I'm sliding up the staircase. You know, this doesn't really. No, oh, no, I'm on low health. Doesn't matter. Uh, the this barricade here does, or this little uh, perch, doesn't matter too much if you can't make use of it. Need more down here to stop me. To stop me. Or you know, not to be shit. The ground quavers, and you look down to see a tunnel beneath the ice. The dragon roars as it thunders after Selimas and Jeets and Taldron. The ruse is working. It's it just kind of sauntering more than thundering, to be honest. And it would suck if, you know, the dragon just, like, broke the ice. Then we'd be Another stuck. heavy door bars the way out. Once again, signal crystals are set into the wall. Just seeing all this ice is just flashing me back to, um, I think it was Jack and Daxter. Um, uh, might be Jack and Daxter? Hmm, might be thinking of a different game. It's some old uh, platformer I used to play. A up, A up. Would love to, um, play him again. Oh, I know. Christ. Gonna have to rest now next thing we get to. I was hoping we'd get through without doing so, just because I don't wanna. But, um, it seems prudent that we do. A signal crystal glows with power as you engage the first control lever. But where is the second? Also, actually, I should be using this, and I should be using you. Do you. And then I will use Smite Evil on, um... Um... You know, next group of enemies. Well, not, maybe not the next... Uh, Maybe not necessarily the very next, but uh, near enough. Ooh, I just noticed how little health I have even after resting. Did I lose that much from falling, or did I really heal that little? If I really healed that little, that's a bit annoying. I'll be fine. I got lay on hands, which is plenty powerful. Really, just the. Uh, Elemental damage that they do that's that it does me in. They can't really hurt hurt me too much with the other stuff. Ooh. It's it is kind of faded and faint, and it's not faded in a this is an old tank sort of way. Frozen air gust in from the newly opened door below. It just kind of comes off to me that it's uh, you know just a little res than anything else, but. Um, It does take away from it a little, but it is kind of cool for what they're, we're going for. Okay, I think... Oh, wrong way. I think we are reaching the end. And it is kind of cool that you can see under the ice and see the others, you know, running away from the dragon. It would be nice if dragon, dragon didn't look like it was sauntering, but you get what you get. Did 
then again, maybe it's it looks more it's more closed down there, so it can't just you know run. It's got to move slowly. Plus ice, maybe. Uh, whatever. Surprised there's a ton of mooks. The depressing thing is, these were once the villagers, but, but you know they have been, you know, you know, broken and whatnot. It's kind of depressing that they can't be, you know, saved. Okay, there's another rest shrine, but I'll be fine. Our foes upon us. Summon the demon now, and we can't actually stop them. So cold. Ice Fwens Fwenzer. May as well just they may as well just charge me themselves. That is actually kinda cool okay. Our lives did nothing. We must stop the interlopers. It seems not only your lives did nothing, but ye are yourself yourselves. God damn. Like, you know, they're just utter pansies. Oh. Just to start the uh, spawning. Ooh. Nice. Three more potions. And a shield of... Potion of Shield of Fate. Nice. Potions are bloody handy. And some more money. The zombies aren't even worth, you know, talking about, to be honest. Just cannon fodder. There is the Rex Sticks, Octend, and then the Dragon, and a Horde of Gold. Can I take some? Is that what a mind flare looks like? I... Oh, this, from the back, it looks different than I expected. I'm used to how they look like in uh, Neverwinter Nights. Uh, one. I'm not sure two. psychic energy pound into you as you spot a green crystal on the ledge ahead. Yeah, no, that's pretty on par for the course. This must be the quarry mind sunder. Just, uh... Just from the back, it looks different, but I think it's just the robe and cloak and whatnot. The Mind Flayer and Dragon are locked in a contest of wills. This could be your chance to destroy the Mind Sunder. The Mind Flayer shrieks as it loses the Mind Sunder's power. The Dragon reasserts its will and looks very annoyed. Nice! So, buddy! Can I, uh, take some of your gold? Wouldn't want to chance my arm, really. It's a, uh... Hey, over here. Wished. Uh, I remember from my little knowledge of the lore of d, &D I know the... Metal dragons are the nice ones. The non-metal dragons are tend to be goits. So, yeah. There's, like, metal dragons. I think some can spew acid or something. I'm not really sure. Maybe that's the green dragons... Uh, Oh, I, I, I don't know enough. Um, again, no, every no confused. Next time you fight the dragon, and I'll break the crystal. <laughs> Next time, let me be, be the higher level person. And they're all fine. You are a wonder, Durkar. To be truthful, I did not actually think this plan would work. I was ready to die in a blaze of glory. We won. When I, I wonder what will, what, will, what will challenge me now that I face a dragon. Well, technically you didn't. You face the pansies trying to mind control a dragon. Ha! Well, don't worry. There's always a bigger evil beyond the horizon. In fact, speak with Rindar the Tirani, if you truly fancy an adventure. He's uh, at the pier, a village pier, and he can take you to Stormreach. You'll find plenty of evil there. <laughs> uh, I'll seek him out at the Cortos docks. Thank you, and for a while, Lars Hayden. Yeah. Take this portal. 
So you won't have to walk back. Do I get a chest? No. Uh, can Next time you fight the dragon and I'll break the crystal. It will take hours to remove the fang marks from my armor. Well struck. I wish we'd dispatch the dragon, but such a feat is beyond my abilities. And I can't believe. Alright, just go through the magical door. Woo! Kinda of hoping for some like money. Magic, well, the I stopped. Savior of Corthos! They cheer as you return. But destiny has greater plans for you than just this small village. So, where's my harem? Uh. I came all this way to sample Sigmund's favorite uh, old soy grog. Everyone's rather distracted, I'm afraid. Uh, we'll talk with you first. Your work is quite satisfactory. The mistress is safely back in her quarters aboard the Sojourn. She has empowered me to offer you one of these items for payment. Blessed goggles, which gives you, uh, well, you to bless you and your allies. It gives you one morale bonus to attack rolls and saves against fear. To bless counters and dispels bane. Oh, well, better be careful not cast that near, with TB nearby. I can get um, ornate goggles. Which give me search one and disable device one, um, or di goggles of insight that give me attack bonus, uh, attack bonus one. I won't be using any of these. I'm happy with what I have, so I will take. Uh, an uh, I'll take the best goggles. What's this? You say the dragon is gone? Brilliant, glorious. On behalf of my thankful crew, I hereby offer you passage to the Jewel of Zendrick, the city of Stormreach. Just talk to Valeria Cinderwind, uh, Cin yeah, Cinderwind at the dock here. Thank you. And to complete our set, I can get the gift this here, Anger's Gift. But you can get another item, a gem later on, that will actually take th fit the slots of any of these. Like within the set, there, it's a like these. This set is a two-item set, and like for sorry, let me start again. You know all these small sets here; they're all two-item sets. There's a gem you can go later that can fit, and you know the necklace. Take this place of the necklace item, um, for any of these sets. It seems, um, but it won't provide like say like, you know, the minor mnemonic aid. It won't gi give you that ability. It will only count for the completion of the set. So, yeah. Uh, you won't get the strength and resistance here bonus. It will just give you the plus two to hit from completing the set. So, it's cool in its own way, but... Um, yeah. Damn, I wouldn't mind Protector's Heart. Uh, Protector's, uh... What's that on the other one? Damn it. I should have taken, um... That. Eh. We'll go with this. We'll go with this. Plus, it answers my uh, issue with accuracy. Fantastic. Also like the little effect there. Anger's Wrath. Uh, this item set will give you plus two to hit with all attacks. Never. This is actually the first item set I've ever gotten. Um, it, I think it was new. I think this is new gear to the game. I think some item, uh, some NPCs can take you to different destinations all over the world of e Eberron. These travel NPCs show up as green compass stars on your map. Each one is, is, is also easily identifiable, with a green compass icon floating up over the NPC's head. So, I just talk to you. Ahoy there! The Sojourn will be leaving for Stormreach Harbor soon. Do you need passage? Yes, I'd like to go to Stormreach. Um, and you can go back. But anyway, we can find uh, collectible items now in dungeons. And they can be given to different NPCs for rewards. Obviously, we'll be getting the low tier of stuff, so they won't be a big deal.